So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in Task Manager. Click on it. And then once you're on this, if you see either Riot Client, Riot Vanguard or League of Legends open, you want to close it. So you can scroll down on this list. If you see either Riot Client, Riot Vanguard or League of Legends open, you want to close it. And now to close it, imagine that this is either one of those three that I just mentioned right now. You want to click on it and then click on End Task. This will now close it. Now for the second step, you're going to head over to Search and type in Services. Click on it. And now once you're on this, you're going to click on any service one time and then click on V on your keyboard. Now you want to find VGC. I don't have it on my computer, but you're going to be having VGC. Once you find VGC, you're going to double click on it. Make sure that you have the startup type on automatic and then click on start, which will now make the service status running and then click on OK. So now once you have VGC on both automatic and running, you now want to click on restart, which is now going to restart the service. And then once you've done that, you can now open up League of Legends and then this should now fix your problem. If that's still not working, then for the second method, you want to head over to search and type in add or remove programs. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you want to find Riot Vanguard. So we're going to scroll down till we find Riot Vanguard. I don't have it on my computer, but once you find Riot Vanguard, you want to click on the three dots and then click on uninstall. Then you want to uninstall Riot Vanguard. And now after you uninstall Riot Vanguard, you just want to restart your computer. Now you want to open up League of Legends again. And then it's going to reinstall Riot Vanguard for you automatically. And then this should not fix your problem. 